The Gunner Hunter is a high-speed gunslinger who dances around the battlefield, riddling enemies with endless bullets from their twin machine guns. Sacrificing defense for mobility, this class does best when not taking damage at all, but can take a hit or two here and there. Let's take a look at this build's skill trees. First, put 3 points into ranged power up 1, which will unlock the rest of the class. Next, grab sidestep jump, first art's perfect attack addition, air reversal, perfect recovery and attack combo, and double jump when you reach the required levels. When you reach level 80, max out high level bonus gunner for a 105% damage boost. Be sure to max out twin machine guns mastery, which increases your PP recovery and critical hit damage when using twin machine guns. Next, Grab Dive Roll Shot so you can attack while dodging. Twin Machine Gun's Focus is next, which grants the gunner a focus gauge that charges when they land attacks with Twin Machine Guns and increases the damage you deal as it fills. But taking damage will decrease it, so be sure to practice dodging. Twin Machine Gun's Stylish Charge will eliminate the time it takes to charge Photon Hearts or techniques used in a combo when Twin Machine Guns are equipped. Next, Max out Point Blank Boost 1 and 2 and 0 range critical. This will grant you a 220% damage boost when you use ranged weapons in close range, while also granting a 50% increase in critical hit rate. Next, put 5 points in Attack PP Restorate, which will restore PP faster when using normal attacks, and max out Perfectionist, which grants a 120% damage boost when your HP is 75% or greater. Showtime is one of the core skills a gunner uses, and we will put just 2 points into it. Showtime is a 45 second buff that greatly increases the speed your focus gauge charges, while also greatly increasing your threat, causing enemies to focus on you. This is upgraded by putting 3 points into Showtime Star, grabbing Encore Time and Time Save, and maxing out High Time. When all is said and done, Showtime will give you extra max PP while active, increase the speed your focus gauge increases while also filling it over time, and reduce the amount of the gauge you lose when taking damage. On top of that, if you manage to take no damage while it's active, it will reactivate once for free. The other core skill we use is Chain Trigger, which we will max out, along with all its upgrades. When Chain Trigger is used, the next target you hit will start a chain, which has a value that goes up anytime anyone hits it with a normal attack. When you strike this chain with a photon art, the chain stops accumulating and you gain a photon art damage multiplier for a few seconds based on the chain's score. This is a great mechanic for bossing. Lastly, we have Stylish Roll Up, Stylish Roll Finisher, and Stylish Roll Perfect Attack Bonus, which grants extra damage when using the gunner's weapon action and allows us to trigger Stylish Roll as a Photon Art instead of a normal attack. We use the standard Hunter sub tree for this build. We will first put 6 points in HP up 1. At level 80, we also put 5 points in a high level Bonus Hunter, in order to get another 105% damage bonus. Be sure to max out Perfect Attack Bonus 1 and 2 to gain a 220% damage boost when landing Perfect Attacks. Fury Stance is an essential part of our build. Maxing out every component of Fury Stance will grant us a range damage bonus, while also granting a 25% increase in critical hit rate. Next, putting 3 points into Guard Stance will give us access to the skill Automate Half, which we will max out. This skill makes us automatically use a potion when we drop below 50% HP. Lastly, we will max out Iron Will and Stalwart Spirit which together grant a 75% chance to survive a fatal blow with one hit point, and when you do, grants 15 seconds of invincibility, which will give you a chance to heal before getting injured again. For traveling, we use the Photon Art Grim Barrage, which makes us corkscrew forward and fire our guns twice. Dodging or using our weapon action right before the attack will cancel it and allow us to use the art again essentially allowing us to corkscrew everywhere we need to go. For mobbing, a chosen Photon Arts are True Equilibrium, which can be used to take down tankier mobs, and Desperado Dance, which rapidly fires bullets in all directions at once. For bossing, 
we combine high levels of chain trigger with satellite aim, which is very close range but hits enemies with a lot of force. On bosses that move around a lot, true equilibrium can also be used. The skill rings we want to use are TMG Stance Up, which increases damage with twin machine guns, and Critical Strike Ranged, which increases the critical hit rate and damage of ranged attacks. Lastly, you should be using a ranged mag, with 200 levels of ranged support. 